Hello guys, welcome to our online web tutor presented by Profotic Solutions team. I am Sanjay. We are learning WordPress hooks tutorial for beginners and this is part 15. In this video session guys, we are going to start about filter hooks and we will see about our first filter hook that is the title. And also guys, if you are a beginner to this channel then please don't forget to subscribe and keep watching our previous video sessions to get the clear concept about WordPress hooks tutorial. So basically guys, this is the documentation study link of WordPress. By following this link, actually you can get the whole concept about the filter hook that is the title. So basically guys, what is filter hooks? As we have seen so far about the action hooks in WordPress, where we had discussed about the several hooks in WordPress. So if we go to editor, so by the help of a plugin guys, here we have used multiple action hooks to understand about the WordPress hooks. Okay, so we are going to start about the second stage of our hooks tutorial that is called about filter hooks. So basically the main question is about something called what is a filter hook. So if you go to the, our theoretical portion, so filter hooks are those hooks in WordPress which basically manipulates data before and after being saved and outputted means suppose when we are going to save the data to our database then now at that time actually filter hook works when we suppose output any data from our database to the output screen then filter hook works so these are the two conditions guys according to these two conditions actually we can make our custom code to our filter hooks and by the help of those filter hooks we can actually manipulate the data in our wordpress setup so basically guys, this is the definition section of of about the filter hook in WordPress. So we are going to study about the first filter hook that is called the title. So basically, as we know that the the title is a function of WordPress basically used to show the title of a page, the title of a post in WordPress. If we go to the administrator panel, and now this is the WordPress setup and now this is the documentation study link by the following this link guys actually you can get the whole concept about the title filter hook so basically when we move to the description section of this filter hook the title is a filter applied to the post title retrieve from the database prior to the printing on the screen in some cases such as the title is used the title can be suppressed by returning a false value okay so basically guys if you go to our administrator panel click on the post section or clicking on the pages section okay so if you go to about the click on view section or let's click on sample page so basically if you go to the sample page section this is called the title of the page called sample page and this is the content section okay so how can we actually get the code of this page if you go to the folder structure this is our setup just go to WP content and now inside themes folder this is the current activated theme called 2017 Inside this activated theme guys, just click on page.php. This is the page actually responsible to display all the pages in WordPress setup. Okay, actually all these things, all the folder structure of a theme we have discussed in our WordPress theme development tutorial. Okay, so just scroll down. As we can see that inside this while loop, we have a get template part function. By the help of function, we have included the page.php file or the page template. So inside that, this is the folder pa part known as template parts so if you go to folder structure this is template parts inside this we have to go inside pages folder and now this is the page folder inside that we have to include called content page.php and this is the page so if we click that it just scroll down now here we can see the the title function is used so basically the title is function is used to display the title of our page Okay, and now this is the H1 element which is used to wrap this title section. Okay, so if you go to the browser, just inspect this sample page. And now we can see that this sample page is a title actually wrapped inside this H1 element with class and the title. Okay, so this is not our main concern. Main concern is that how can we manipulate this data before sending to the output screen or before saving to the database table. So basically guys, we are going to update this title, we are going to update this data before sending it to the output screen. Okay, so just back to editor. So for manipulating those data guys, we are going to use our filter hooks. Okay, so basically how can we declare a filter hook? So we have to add called add filter function is here. Okay, so let's say add filter. Inside add filter, we have to use called the title because we are going to use or to manipulate the title section of our WordPress page. Okay, second parameter we have to use the callback function. Okay, so let's say that OWT, let's say filter, 
title okay this is the callback function name so just make sure that you need to define this callback function right here okay so let's say that OWT filter title so inside this title guys we have to first pass a parameter inside this function because as we know that this actually filter hook works when any title displays on the page section okay so let's say that here is something called title now inside this function block guys now we are after getting the title after getting the title means after getting the sample page as the page name we are going to manipulate this data so let's say that return let's say that OWT or let's say updated dash call title okay so if we save this page go to administrator panel or the page section reload this page now as we can see that the title has been changed from sample page to OWT updated sample page because we have used the filter hook called the title okay so when we open any of the page if I click on OWT Ajax or privacy policy just click on view if we if I click on the view section as we can see that the page name has pre-painted the value called OWT updated this is the prefix that we have added by right here okay so this is the use of the filter hook in the WordPress basically guys the filter hook or filter hooks are basically to use to manipulate the data before saving to the database or to the output of the output screen okay so if you go to administrator panel now as we can see that here we have the list of pages basically this is the title section of our all the pages that we have created okay so when we reload this page when we reload this page now this page title this page title actually prepaint the value called OWT updated because these are also the title section of pages okay and now by the action or the by the filter hook called the title we have manipulated this data okay so just reload this page now as we can see that the, all the pages name has been pre-painted a value called OWT updated this is the prefix that we have added right here so when we move to the slide section so basically guys the title function while it calling in WordPress while it calls then that without directly calling it goes to our plugin where we have actually made the filter hook okay now by going to this function by going to this callback function it output the title of the WordPress page okay so I think guys that by the help of this video session I have made much more clear concept about the filter hook called the title so next filter hooks we will study in our upcoming videos okay so if you have any doubt in this video session guys then please drop your comment I will give my reply as soon as possible so for this video session guys thank you for watching have a great day